So on the Farne Islands in the spring and summer, you can experience an amazing array of wildlife. It's mainly a seabird colony with over 80,000 pairs of seabirds. So this year we've got a very exciting new project where we can actually see into the lives of the puffins themselves. We've actually got puffins nest underground and cut under the cover of darkness. No one ever really sees, not even us as, as rangers living here. We don't really understand the, the brain biology of a puffin once it goes down underground. And, um, and this year, we're going to be able to see a snapshot. We're going to have these live cameras beaming images back to the visitor centre on in a farm to reveal what goes on on a daily basis. It's going to be so exciting to see the pair come down, to, to, to lay their first egg, and then to incubate it, and then hopefully go on to hatch it and then raise it. So we'll be able to see a whole new world for the next three months. The birds will be with us. It's well worth coming along to the islands and seeing this whole thing in action. We've got a full census of the puffin population, which we only complete once every five years, just because of the magnitude of the job. Now, the last survey in 2008 revealed some startling uh, results for, for our puffins. We actually saw a 33% decrease in, in, in the population from the previous census. So it was worrying times. So this year, we're hoping to see what impact, if any, the weather has had of recent and uh, whether our population has actually managed to bounce back. So here on the Far Islands, the National Trust would like to thank Panasonic, Holden and Handycam for their time and support for the equipment which has been provided for on, on the farms here. Without them, this would never be possible to actually bring the Puffin Cam live to the visitor centre to hopefully show the 45,000 visitors we're going to have on the islands this year.